The help of several animals contributes to others' existence, and we don't think humans are an exception. We can always hear about some species we need to save, but have you ever thought why? The animals play many roles in preserving the survival of human beings and the planet. We got the benefits from the services of these creatures for free. Here we discuss the top 10 animals that humans need to survive. Number 10. Bees Bees are the first farmer in the world. There are 20,000 different bee species and almost 4,000 bees contribute to pollination. They have two stomachs, one stomach for eating while the other for storing honey. Humans partially domesticated the bees, which are the only social insects doing like this. They are better known for their stinging buzzing and making honey. However, their existence has a vital role in humans. Communication of these honeybees takes place through dancing. They pollinate about 80% of the vegetables and fruits that humans usually consume. These include berries, broccoli, cantaloupe, apples, asparagus, avocados, soybeans, cucumbers, squash, etc. All the working bees are female. This hardworking small insect transfers pollen from flower to flower on its daily routes across the world. This process allows humans to depend on trees, plants, and flowers to survive and grow. Losing bees can affect not only humans, but also substantial financial impact too. The honey production industry has an essential role in the world. Climate change, disease, human interaction, and pesticide usage can decrease in bees up to 80% in the world's specific parts. Thus, it offers things that are far more critical than delicious honey. So, the bees are one of the animals that humans need to survive. Number 9. Plankton Plankton is a tiny marine organism. It has a vital role in balancing the ecosystem because it provides food to a vast range of species, from small bivalves to whales. They stay in one place like coral. Additionally, these non-mobile creatures are unable to swim against the sea's tides and currents. Plankton is of two types, zooplankton and phytoplankton, which are weak swimming animals and tiny plants respectively. Why are these microscopic algae more critical in humans' life? They cover the energy into oxygen that we can all breathe and distribute this oxygen around the world. There are more than 50,000 different freshwater plankton species in the ocean's light zone. Both phytoplankton and zooplankton absorb nutrients from the water and energy from the sun. Additionally, these two ingredients are necessary for the process of photosynthesis. Plankton photosynthesis provides half of the Earth's oxygen, while the other half was coming from trees and other plants photosynthesis on land. Phytoplankton has an essential role in space travel because it acts as a food and gas exchange source. Number 8. Ants The ants are pretty spectacular critters encountered in homes and businesses. There are more than 12,000 known species of ant occur around the globe. They also have some unique capabilities. Besides humans, these used social insects are the only creatures that will farm other animals. They're using chemicals known as pheromones to communicate and cooperate effectively to their fellows. Although they may be tiny, ants can carry 50 times the body weight of them. They typically feed upon fungus, nectar, seeds, or insects. Ants dig the tunnels that irate the soil, and nutrients can also get into the near plant's grounds and roots. This process helps to make and maintain healthy soil conditions of plants and our food to grow. Ants help to reduce the chemical fertilizer's use and the requirement for irrigation. The ants can increase 36% of weed crop yields, but it is true, ants have a vital role in coffee and chocolate production. They also participate in seed harvesting and seed carrying to their precious nutrient nests, where the plants can grow safely, free from herbivores' harm. When they travel long distances with plant seeds, granting the plants to achieve the desired goal of spread over a wide area for less light, nutrition, pace, and water competition with other plants. They can destroy the pest species like fleas, fly and bed bug eggs, nymphs, or larvae. Ants consume small fleshy structures on the seed's outer surface called aliosomes without harm the plant. They also help the rainforest cleaning up and keep the ecosystems in very much balance. So they are saving people sometimes and we need to keep them safe. So when you encounter an ant, perhaps think twice about the uses of them in the next time. Number 7. Bats Bats are one of the insect's largest consumers. There are over 1,200 species worldwide. Almost all species of bat hang upside down. Habitats of bats are trees, caves, and buildings. They also eat various insects such as mosquitoes, which can carry diseases like malaria and other mosquito-borne diseases. The bats which are eating nectar can also help to pollinate. Additionally, their droppings, called guano, is the most abundant fertilizers which help in dispersal of seed and assisting the plants in growing and staying diverse. Many bat species provide essential services that include clean water, pollination, disease control, and insect regulation. A fungal disease like white noise syndrome afflicts these tiny bats. Due to the bats' limbs not supporting their weight, they hang upside down when resting. The bat's group is known as a colony, while the bat's baby is called a pup. If not controlled, the insects can decimate plant life and crops, 
mostly the pest type insects. Most bats feed upon insects and some species eat fish, fruit, or even blood. Did you know that the bats are the only mammals capable of flight? Nowadays, habitat loss and deforestation are a threat to these flying mammals. Bats can stay up to 20 years. It has got a full right to be here on the list of top 10 animals that humans need to survive. Number 6. Frogs There are over 6,000 species of frogs in the world. This fantastic creature is better known for its croaking sounds, jumping abilities, slimy skin, and bulging eyes. The frog skin has the capability of absorbing water, so they do not need to drink. They catch their prey using their tongue. Frogs use leaping and jumping as a means of evading predators. These carnivorous frogs mainly eat insects and other invertebrates. Some species of frog also feed on small animals, including mice, birds, and snakes. They also make vocalizations that typically function as mating calls. Some of these amphibians have a bright colored body to warn their predators that they are poisonous. Frogs have very excellent eyesight and a good sense of hearing. Frogs use their legs to dig or burrow underground for hibernating. They act as bio-indicators. The frog's pores and permeable skin can absorb substance present in the environment or surrounding habitat within their fatty tissues. They can live both terrestrially and aquatically. Also, they can indicate contamination or other issues for both habitats. Since these miraculous frogs will be the first animals to react to any biological hazards, they benefit from warning signs for humans to take action. They conclusively show the health of different ecosystems. Nowadays, the extinction of frog species is at risk because of infectious diseases such as chytridiomycosis and habitat destruction. Though frogs not as effective as bats, they do help in the control of insects. These short-boiled, tailless amphibians act as a food source for any carnivore species and maintain balanced ecosystems. So, frogs are one of the animals that humans need to survive. Number 5. Fungi We can find these living organisms all over the Earth. There are almost 1.5 million species on the planet. Unlike plants, cell walls of fungi are complex and flexible structures made up of chitin. Fungi cannot make their own food, and they are eating off hosts of them or decomposing matter. The spores reproduce these fungi. Fungi are eukaryotic, which means that cells of them consist of organelles and a nucleus inside the membrane walls. People sometimes eat fungi such as mushrooms and truffles for food. Fungi divided into four groups, including sac fungi, club fungi, molds, and imperfect fungi. Moreover, people use these fungi to make medicine, including antibiotics such as penicillin. People also use the type of fungi called yeast in baking, which helps them create bread to rise. The fungi allow the plants to obtain the water and nutrients from the soil around these organisms. The plants cannot absorb these crucial components of life directly into the earth. Fungi are also nature's leading nutrient recyclers. They decompose the remnants of dead plants and animals and return the nutrient to nature and reuse them. The fungi's fruiting body is freeing spores that infect insects and grow through exoskeletons or even suffocating them. Sometimes they make deadly toxins to increase the speed of the process. Thus, they control pests. Modern medicine also depends on fungi. People even use fungi to treat cancer. The tinctures of the mushroom fungi could protect the immune system of the bees from the virus. Some species can capture and keep the carbon in the soil, extracting it from the air. However, fungi have a vital role in the health of health. We know that without fungi, we can't see healthy soil. And without healthy soil, we can't see happy trees. And then without trees, that affects the survival of humans. It also holds a position in the list of top 10 animals that humans need to survive. Number 4. Fish Every person may like to eat fish, or even keep them as pets in the aquarium. There are more than 30,000 different kinds of fish. Fish live as well as breathes in water. Fish species are cold-blooded, which means their internal body temperature changes as the surrounding changes. Additionally, they have excellent senses of touch, sight, taste, and some species possess a unique understanding of hearing and smell. These vertebrates fish protect themselves from their enemies is to blend in or camouflage with their environment. Fish provide an essential food source but they also help clean up oceans and fight against climate change. Fish feed upon fish, mollusks, other fish, aquatic plants, algae, water birds, turtles, zooplankton, terrestrial insects, frogs, snakes, and mice. In some species, the females and males have bodies with a different shape or different color. In other species, we can't find a visible difference. The fish may help to reduce climate change impacts with their excrement. The excrement of fish can significantly reduce the ocean's acidity. In maintaining an ocean's delicate pH balance, the waste of fish flows to the water surface and ultimately dissolves. So they create carbon dioxide that helps to form the ocean.
oceans acidity, overfishing, and habitat destruction are the biggest threats to them. Thus, it holds a position in one of the animals that humans need to survive. Number three, worms. There are over 2,700 various types of worms in the world. Worms are cold-blooded and can eat their weight in each day. Scents of the worms used to attract the other worms. Earthworms use their skin for breathing and don't have lungs. They are plowing via the soil and making complex burrow networks. They create an essential contribution to the land's fertility and are very important in farmland and garden. If the skin of a worm dries out, they will die. These worms' main habitats include tropical rainforests, in the branches of trees, on mountains, and even nests of birds. These wriggly, slimy, little worms play a vital role in making fertile soil that helps the plants grow healthy and bear fruit. They are hermaphrodites and possess male and female reproductive organs, but it takes two to reproduce. It has five hearts. It reduces the waste amount sent to landfills. For many years, people are putting or throwing out the waste straight into the garbage disposal, but today they have started worm composting systems. Besides, a worm composting system's usage can create excellent fertilizer for our garden and other plants. These invertebrate animals also help to cut down on the accumulation of waste. Worms can live the areas such as where they got oxygen, food, moisture, and a favorable temperature. Many animals and plants get their food from the soil, but the worms eat the soil itself. These underground creatures can live up to four to five years. Number two, primates other than humans. There are over 704 species and subspecies of primates. Extinction is a significant threat. These mammals have forward-facing color vision, fingernails, soft hands and feet, opposable thumbs, and large, highly developed brains. These primates mainly live in tropical or subtropical regions. Additionally, they have longer lifespans. It is also one of the top 10 animals that humans need to survive. Primates divided into four classifications include great apes, lesser apes, monkeys, and prosimians. These social animals can use the tools. Like humans, most of the primates give birth to only a single newborn at a time. These omnivorous animals feed upon fruits, leaves, insects, and small lizards. Eagles, jaguars, and even human beings preyed on them. All primate species show sexual dimorphism. The habitats of these animals support the ecosystem, which all dependent. They are absorbing carbon while releasing oxygen via the process of photosynthesis. Also, they are pumping water into the air via evapotranspiration, which activates the global rainfall patterns. Moreover, primates drug droppings plant the seeds for tomorrow's trees and keep those forests growing and healthy. Without such ecosystems, they have no permanent carbon source. If there are fewer trees in the rainforests, only a small amount of moisture goes into the atmosphere, so the rainfall is reduced and also decline the water supplies. Number one, birds. There are over 10,000 different species of birds in the world. The warm-blooded birds generally have wings, lay eggs, feathers. People kept many birds as pets, including doves, parakeets, and lovebirds. These vertebrae animals adapted for flight. Many birds can also run, jump, swim, and dive and it has a unique digestive system. These warm-blooded vertebrae are better known for their ability to fly. It is also one of the animals that humans need to survive. Every year, around 20% of species of birds migrate long distances. Some birds are intelligent to create and use the tools and have help. Some birds are intelligent to create and use the tools and have hollow bones that help them fly. Birds perform best in insect control, nutrient recycling, forest decomposition, pollination, seed sowing, bioindication of ecosystem health, and soil aeration. Birds can keep systems in balance. They also inspire humans with aesthetic magnificence of them. We cannot imagine the world without the visual and acoustic beauty of these creatures. The world's smallest living bird is the bee hummingbird, with a length of just two inches. Moreover, birds use the tail feathers for steering, and they use beaks to swallow food. They do not wish to carry the additional weight of young inside their bodies. They lay the eggs and incubate in a nest. We can find most species of birds in tropical rainforests. Feathers hide the bird's total need. The world's most significant egg lays in ostrich. What are your thoughts on this list? Definitely, the animal kingdom is still full of mysteries and surprises. We upload new videos every week, so don't forget to subscribe to the channel.